Hello again, everybody. You know what the Champions Indoor Football League said today? We're going to release our revised 2021 schedule because we added a team for no reason that does not, you know, that isn't even close to, you know, our other members in our league. Once again, you know, just unprofessional as hell. You know, adding teams after you've already released the schedule does not make any sense. And the schedule that they've released now still doesn't make any sense. It baffles me. Um, if you're in a league with eight teams and you're trying to schedule, you know, a 10-game season, you'd expect to play everybody at least once during that time. This does not happen here. It does not happen at all. And keep in mind, um, we still have those extra games that uh, that are against non-league opponents that do not make any sense whatsoever and should not be on the schedule. You know, but whatever, whatever, you know, whatever. And Wyoming, you guys will open up against um, Allen. That's not a team that's in this league. I'm assuming it's a semi-pro team, or maybe it's even the Allen Tiger Cats, the AAL. I have no idea. But Ricky, Ricky, someone tell him, someone, someone tell him, someone tell these guys out there in the CIF, hey, this, this has got to get better. You cannot be scheduling teams like Queen City, or the Crusaders. Who are the Crusaders? I have no idea who the Crusaders are. Are they a semi-pro team? Are they an outdoor team or something like that? Or are they, you know, something even lower than the AAL? Because those exist and we talked about those already. But yeah, um, so now with the addition of Wyoming, you think that they play everybody on this in the league. But no, that's not happened. Um... And, you know, the season's supposed to end on June the 13th. Yeah, the 13th, as I'm looking on the other side of my screen here. And it will start March the 12th. But these game, but those games on March 12th do not matter. They are merely exhibitions that should not count. It should not even be in the schedule. If you're going to have, you know, an 11-game season, why not just up it to 12? You know, and have, you know, everybody play 12 games like you have been trying to do for the past several years now, even though teams fold mid-season and whatnot, but we're not going to talk about that right now. Um, yeah, this is an updated schedule for the CIF. It is just, just, and I was just like scrolling down Facebook and trying to see, you know, what in the world's going on, you know. You know, personally and stuff like that, but there's never any notifications for me on there. Uh, and then I saw the CIF schedule for 2021, and it looks bad. Like I don't even know, I don't even know how to describe it. Like you can go take a gander for yourself. Go to the CIF's Facebook page. Go ahead and see the schedule for yourself. And for an eight-team league, you know, I mean, you think, hey. There's seven other teams. Again, there's seven other teams in that you play. And we will play three more twice for ten games. But no, no, not at all. Like, Wyoming doesn't even get to play Selena, uh, the Liberty. What, what's the point of that? They don't get to play Amarillo, the Venom, either. Unless it's like the playoffs or something, which is, you know going to be a thing and it's going to be the top four once again I assume because uh, yeah it should be the top four teams again in the playoffs but there's not going to be any divisions this time around because you know the geographical differences is too much you know there would be like at, at the Wikipedia page is probably just as bad like they still had the like the wikipedia page still has the north and south divisions up on there even though that doesn't exist anymore and if a, and if that were to be in place then you know the 
Mustangs would be in the north, and it'd be a five-team, you know, north and three-team south. So that did, so that's not gonna work. So you know, just an eight-team table. It works out better anyway, because you don't have to um, abide by the rules of the divisions and whatnot and make up stuff. So it's just the top four teams that make the playoffs. But yeah, ten games plus. For most teams, probably all of them, I'm not really sure. Don't really care um, that there's exhibitions. And yeah, CIF fumbled the ball again. The EAL is going to fumble the ball again soon when they release their schedule and West Virginia is not on there, probably. But yeah, whatever. So with that being said, everybody, y'all take care. I'll see you next video very, very shortly.